A lot of a lot of different parts of this device are removable. On the visor, you've got the light seal right here. This this ships with two of these as well. During the setup process, you do a scan of your face. That's a lot like Face ID, and uh, these are the optical inserts right here. So again, during the sign up process, if you send your prescription to Zeiss, they will make these custom. We've got the digital crown right here. The two primary uses of it in most apps and the Vision OS are uh, for the environments. So you can turn up and down the transparency of the environments, which are those like fully immersive shots that you've seen. These are the speakers on the side right here. Um, you probably know that if you have a pair of AirPods Pro, you can link those as well. This is the first place where spatial audio actually really kind of starts to make a lot of sense as you turn your head and things are fixed in space. Power button right here, we've got some where the eyesight would come in. So during the initial setup process, when you first put this on, it's going to ask you to do a facial scan, as I mentioned, facial ID before. And then when somebody, a human is in your line of vision, it will pop up those sort of like weird looking eyes up here to let them know that you're that you're looking at them. And then that is also used to form your persona. Moving on to the bottom, we've got a pair of cameras down here that's used for the hand tracking, but the hand tracking is really good. You know, if you're watching a movie or something and you want, uh, th this is gonna do a pretty good job of blocking out most of the light.